Welcome back everyone to the next installment of 999. We did a little bit of investigating after having split up with some people. Seven and Clover went back to go and uh, see if maybe Snake is behind door number three. My guess is no, but I guess we'll find out. In any case, we're now back on sea deck. Huh. So you guys found door number one. So now we've located two new doors, the six door and the one door. It is interesting that E-Deck wasn't flooded. Well, we don't really know if all of E-Deck is safe. We only checked the area around the elevator. Even so, it's still very interesting. You said the sixth door was there, right? Yes. Then it means Zero planned out all this, all, even the sink thing. That would have meant some pretty serious remodeling of the ship's interior. It's pretty mind-blowing when you think about it. Yeah, I, I wonder how long it took. I can't even imagine how much it must have cost. It would have been a ton, for sure. Well, that does go along with what Ace was saying. The most reasonable explanation would be that this was done by some organization with access to a whole lot of cash. Yes, it does make sense. Hmm. 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 Okay. Yeah? Um, I don't think this is a very good idea to stay here. Yeah, you're right. Ace and his team might be back already. Well, June, Jinpei, and I should be able to open door number one. Huh? You guys are leaving me behind? Just kidding. Yeah. Alright, let's go. No, actually, she meant it. Yeah, she right. totally would have done it, too. I know. Which door are you guys going through again? Going back the to wooden hunt? door! Oh my god. Hey, where the hell do you guys go? Seven? Hmm. Hmm. What's wrong? What happened? What the hell kind of a question is that? Snake was... Oh, God. Snake is... Really? Snake is dead. He died just as the ninth man did. We never did see that. Oh my god, that's not true, is it? We should make sure. What? If it's the way Nine did, I, I think say, he, like, it's pretty clear that he would be dead. Yeah, he's cut to a million pieces. We should make sure. That was like um. Take his pulse. There's this one kind of uh. It, it became a popular video on YouTube, I think. It was this one video in one of the PS2 and GameCube Mortal Kombat games where like some guy get like run through with a spear or something or like. He's abs it was absolutely a fatal wound. Someone goes up to him and goes, Are you okay? <laughs> it's like, Are dude, you okay? Yeah. Y yeah, right. We should. Wait. Not that way. What? Why not? So if I had gone through door three, I would have seen Snake? You can see the Snake, yes. Wow. Uh, so I think this might have been the scene I was thinking about where, like, there's... In the original version, there was, like, an exceptionally excruciating detail of gore, but... Uh, I don't know if they rewrote parts of that for yeah. the remake of the game. I guess we'll see. Uh, I stuck a screwdriver in there to keep the door from closing all the way. It's not locked, so you can go in that way. And we just didn't run into this when we were going back the other way. Yeah. Where is... Where is he? The, the shower room on the left side of the hallway. I put a broom in there, too, to keep the door open. Oh, I, I guess that's true. All the doors lock when you're going back through them. Yeah. That means we can get in without going through the number doors, right? Yeah, that's right. Then let's go. All of us going to confirm. This wasn't open when we passed here before. Well, let's keep going. This music. Dun, dun. Ugh, it smells horrible. Ugh, yeah, this is pretty awful. I feel like I'm gonna puke. Er Where is he? Where's Snake? Oh my god. Wow. <laughs> there. And there. And there. June, you should stay here. But... Please, just do me a favor, okay? Alright? I'm going in. Gasp. Nothing for me, though. Oh, are we gonna see it? I mean... <laughs> Jeez! <laughs> <clears throat> just as Ace said. It's just like the ninth man. The detonator and his bracelet set off the bomb in his gut. Oh god, the bone is coming out of his left arm. 
Hmm. How much of his left arm was lost or artificial? Mm, unless it was important. Yeah. <laughs> that like because again like we didn't necessarily have to hear that from Clover maybe but mm. like. And you didn't that, necessarily have to be on that route to see this. Yeah, well, that, that's the thing. Like, if you're reading, like, a mystery novel, oh, my God, the bone is coming out of his left arm. Like, why would he specify the left arm? Mm -hmm. Like, that's not how people talk. Yeah. yeah. Sure. It's definitely an open fracture. The face. It's horrible. Megan, it's also that, like, the scene is so horrible that they're, like, finding things to focus on so they don't need to take in the... Maybe, but you'd think he would have said the bone was coming out of his arm. Well, you, like, also, the know, left you arm? also know that because it's a narrative. That That's that's what I'm talking yeah. about. Like, oh my god, I, I can't believe he only has four fingers on his left hand. Like, no one's gonna oh, talk like that. God. Yeah, you you can't even tell who it is. Even if you had prosopagnosia. Or <laughs> but the clothes are... No mistake about that. It's Snake. That's all we see. Yeah, that was it. That's about yeah, she had to see that. Goddamn. Sna oh. Snake was probably murdered. Chances are he was killed the same way the ninth man was. It's pretty straightforward. Not that hard to figure out how they did it. First, the killers got Snake to authenticate on the red to open door three. Then they shoved him into it alone and waited nine seconds for the door to shut. Once that door shut, it was all over for Snake, but he didn't give up. He probably knew it wouldn't do him any good, but he probably ran into the shower room looking for the dead. It was a small chance, but it wasn't like he had anything to lose. Unfortunately, it didn't work. The detonator only deactivated if everybody who authenticated when they went in uses the dead. Snake was the only one who went through the door. And then 81 seconds after he was shoved in, that happened. I see. So that's what you meant by killers, huh? You need at least three people to open one of the numbered doors, including Snake. That was a bit subtle, only the S was italicized. Mm -hmm. It wouldn't open for Snake and a single killer. Yeah. That means we're looking at multiple perps here. Perps? Cop talk. Yeah. Or like perpetrator. No, I know. That, that's yeah. what I'm thinking. Like, are you a cop? Because <laughs> that's not really a common thing to say. Or a criminal. Yeah, well, okay. Well, just in case, I want to make sure. Let's say you're right. When do you think Snake was killed? When we all split up to look for the parts for the Reds, I think. Right after that was when we noticed he was gone. Then that means none of us has... Alibi, an alibi. Well, you know, he might talk grammatically incorrect anyway. I, I know. appreciate that you. We were all off searching the rooms we've been assigned, looking for those parts. Yeah. That means anybody could be a killer. Wait a minute, what are you talking about? How can you say that so casually? You're implying that one of us is a killer? At least two. At least? Well, not just one of us. If I'm right, then at least two of us are murderers. Why don't you calm down a bit, Seven? What are you going to gain by being so suspicious? That's what Zero wants, you know. Why don't you relax? Take a, a soporific, uh... A soporil beta. Soporil beta. It really takes the edge off. <laughs> what Zero wants? Who cares what Zero wants? Exactly, this game was set up by Zero, wasn't it? Any game has a winner and a loser. Whoever makes it through door 9 is a winner, and those who don't are the losers. Who are you calling loser? Zero is trying to make us fight against one another for that victory. And you're saying that Zero is trying to split us up by making us fight each other? Yes. That is why we can't let ourselves fall prey to suspicion. We have to trust one another to form a strong bond of friendship. Otherwise, we'll end up ensnared by Zero's manipulations. You should instead be ensnared by my manipulations. Yeah, right? Something is kind of bugging me, though. Because Ace really does seem above board. But he did give himself an out when everyone else split up, like as a sacrifice. And we never saw him inject himself. We just saw that he had an empty syringe. Sure. So, I don't know, man. But, I mean, he was also a suspect. Like, it doesn't make him less of a suspect. You know, because he was already a suspect because he was around when... And, like, you can also do some math. You can kind of figure out who could have possibly opened the door. Yeah, but, I mean, what, what I mean is, like, who knows where Bia uh, Biakia... Uh, Biakia. <laughs> yeah. Who, who knows where Snake was when we were all looking for him? Right. But meanwhile, Ace had the shit to himself for that period of time. So he's just even more suspicious, but yeah. everybody is suspicious. Yeah, like, I don't know if he could have done this by himself, though, that's the thing. Mm -hmm. But, like, eh. 
Well, he couldn't have done it by himself. Uh, well, so wait a minute, like, wait, 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 wait. When we were looking for Snake in the first place, before yes. going to a door... No, no, he was just out. Well, no, never mind. So, never mind. so he is, like, one of the primary suspects. So, like, one thing you can think about is, is, um, uh, someone might have the bracelet from the Ninth Man because he's dead. Yeah. So that means that, so since Snake is number two, um, then there are three people who can open the other doors. Yeah. In, in groups of three. You could, there could also be a group of four. So, like, Ace could have done it because they could have opened the three door. And then, um... So the other three. one's seven and eight. So so that would have been seven and uh, June. Oh wait, my memory might be bad, but wasn't wasn't the bracelet hooked up to your heart? Does it not work if you blow up? Pulse is like a pulse. Pulse. Thing. No, the bracelet will still work. It just comes off. Okay. Okay. So I'm sorry. Two. So it could have been June seven and eight and and June pay. So that makes it highly unlikely it was one of them who could have opened the since you were with them. Yeah. All right. So then, does that mean that the person who killed Snake... Yes, almost certainly Zero himself. If there's anyone we should doubt, it should be Zero. He masterminded this game and kidnapped all of us. Doesn't it seem reasonable that he would have killed Snake as well? But that makes no sense, though. The whole thing is to see what we do. Hmm, good question. If Zero killed Snake, then Zero was on the ship with us. Was Zero still on the ship with them? Junpei wasn't... It's so weird. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure. No, Junpei wasn't well, sure. Well, someone has to prompt you if you want to make decisions that aren't motivated or asked by a person yeah. on the, in the group. But I don't... Where could Zero be hiding? In the ceiling. Certainly he was yeah. broadcasting to you at one point in the game. Yeah. I, I think... I think Zero is one of us. Nani! Whoa, that, that scare cord. Yes, that's everyone. <laughs> Was he one of them? Hmm. Well, that's possible. Huh? Like Clover said, Zero might be one of us. What are you saying, Jumpy? Didn't you hear what Ace said? Sounds like you're the Jumpy one. Exactly. I said we shouldn't suspect one another for no reason. No reason? I've got a great reason. And what's that? The bracelets. Why are the bombs in our bodies connected to the bracelets? You're all thinking Zero's hiding somewhere watching us, right? If he's doing that, then he could just detonate the bombs by remote control if someone did something they weren't supposed to. It would be a lot more precise and a lot easier, but if that's the case, then why is the bomb set off by the detonator in the bracelet? Huh, you got a point. I'm not done. Try applying the same ideas to the Nottery game. All the puzzles here run all by themselves. In other words, Zero doesn't have to be controlling them for the game to move forward. Why is that? Why would Zero bother to do something like that? Oh. So, <sighs> let's say you and Clover are right. Zero is one of us. If that's the case, then it'd be really hard for him to keep track of all of us or control anything remotely. That's why all the puzzles run by themselves. That's what you're getting at, right? Yeah. Seven, when we were talking earlier, you said any one of us could be Snake's killer, right? Yeah, something like that. Alright then, I've got a question for you, Ace. You said something like, Zero must be the one who killed Snake, right? Yes, something like that. I can't think of any other explanation. So what do we get if we combine those? They fit together pretty well, I think. Something like this? Whoever killed Snake equals zero, hence zero equals one of Whoa, us. Oh, that sounds like a lot of math. Yeah, what's the what's the root number for that? Seven and Ace's theories aren't mutually exclusive. They actually complement each other pretty well. At least they do if Zero is one of us. What were his motives? His motives? Yes, isn't that pretty important? Well, let's all talk about while we believe one of us is actually the killer. And while time takes away. Hmm. Why would Zero want to hide as one of us? Oh, well, that's because... Um, I don't know. Well, so much for making a persuasive argument, John. Hey, you got pretty far. Yeah. In other words, you had only <laughs> circumstantial evidence. I don't really think that's enough to go on, you know? Gah. Oh, yeah. We have a time limit before we die. That's three. Three hours. It's three in the morning. Oh, I'm tired. Yeah, I got work. Hmm. <laughs> That means we have three hours left. Damn. Then we need to move now. 
Seven, Clover, Junpei, I know how you feel, but you do understand that right now it's important we trust one another, don't you? You're right, but... We must go. We have very little time left. Our next destination is... Mercury. That's really far. I, I was thinking that, yeah. Maybe you and June should check it out first, and then report back to us. Alright, let's go, June. Right. Here it is. Ta-da! Ta-da! The Lotus Devil card. I was just gonna say, doesn't it look little like... We're using this card 7 gave us, right? Yeah. I found it when we were checking out the shower room. I think Seven says something like that. I think we found it when we were checking the shower room. Shower room, shower room. <laughs> anyway, let's see what happens. I guess the elevator works now? Jumpy, I know there's only two of us, but let's do our best. W what's with you all of a sudden? Well, I'm happy we're, to we're put together. Uh, uh, you know it's just for searching e deck, also, right? Also, somebody just died. <laughs> Horribly. Wait, 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 read the room, June. <laughs> <laughs> Even so, I'm glad I'm with you. Oh. Well, first we need to find out the elevator comes out full of water. Just like we did before. June is zero. It's because we just never acknowledged her as a like, girlfriend, <laughs> girlfriend. This is all for you, Jumpy. We really. <laughs> I did it all for all you! All of it so that we could wind up together in this elevator. But what about the other people? I don't Who know. cares? Don't even know them. Oh, here it is. I knew it. It's not wet at all. Let's go. Yes. Look. Nearly all the buttons are destroyed. Yeah, only the C and bottom buttons can be pushed. We're on C deck right now. So the only one we can choose is bottom. It just shoots oh. you at the bottom of the ship. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is a terrible idea. <laughs> Whose idea the was The floor this? just opens from under us. Oh, yeah, well, let's try it out. The ship's bottom. Alright. Oh. The poop deck. <laughs> That's much funnier. <laughs> so this is the bottom deck. Hey, over there? <gasps> oh no, another door. This this is a number door. This is the eighth one we found. But the title said there'd be nine doors. Yeah, I don't even get this game at all. There were two numbered doors on B deck near the central staircase. They were doors four and five. Three more in the large hospital room, doors three, seven, and eight. And the door we found on E deck, and the door Lotus and Santa found on A deck. It was a six on the door on E deck, and a one on A deck. That was June. That means. Do you think the next door we find? Yeah, I think so. The next one's gonna be door nine. Finally. Yeah. You don't look very happy about it, though. Uh, it's not that. I just hope nothing goes wrong. You're right. We should keep our fingers crossed. Yeah, everything's been good so far. <laughs> Let's head back. I'm not dead. Okay. Yeah. The important thing is that we survived. We've lost one person per door so far. Yeah. One, two, three, four... All right, seven pieces. Just double-checking, but everyone wrote their code name and the door number they want, right? Yeah. Yes, just like you told us earlier. Can't believe we're voting here. We need to make the whole thing fair. Body, body. This is a complicated plan, you know. Hurry it up, Mr. I have a brilliant idea. Yeah, yeah, quiet in the peanut gallery. Wait, you're one of the talk, buddy. Alright, let's open these up. The first one says, Ace requests door one. Yes, I do. Would you like me to explain why? We Very much I so. I so much time right yeah. now. No, we don't have the time for that. Sorry, let's keep going. Next to Santa. He wants door number six. Yeah, that's what I wrote. Clover wants one, Lotus wants two, and Seven also wants two. Wait a minute! There's no way I'm going anywhere with the Elephant Man. Wow. That's uh, that's some reference there. No, there'd be no point to the voting for let people change their choices because of stuff like that. But just give it up, Lotus. It's not like I want to hang out with some exhibitionist grandma. Yo, I'm not an exhibitionist. I'm wearing clothes. Barely. So last I checked, that's not a crime. Maybe, but what about common decency? Nobody wants to have to look at a chick who looks like a half-naked raisin. God oh, damn! Jesus Christ. Slow blow after low blow. I'm going to kill you! What, wow. Really? Whoa. Oh, not good. 
Well, the bad news is that there's another dead body. The good news is, is that, that there's that... no longer a debate on the door. <laughs> the good news is that nobody exploded this time. Yeah. Let go! Let go of me! I'm killing him! Junpei, read the rest! <laughs> uh, uh, right. June wants door six. Yes, I don't I don't really have reason, I just felt like it. Thanks. So this was everyone's vote. Ace and Clover requested door one. Seven and Lotus requested door two. Santa and June, or door six. Door I should choose is Okay, the last one is mine. I wanna go through I kinda for safety might wanna do two. So it's Going with June would be like probably what like Oh, I should go with June, but like, man. Yeah, seven I mean, this is Lotus. basically like your option to choose whichever door you want to go through. If yeah. you, there's no trick. You just go through whatever door you pick. Yeah. I'll do two. My choice is door two. Hey, wait a minute there. You cheating? Cheating? I'm asking if you change your number after you heard what doors we wanted. How could I do that? I wrote it down in the paper earlier. Let me see that. Sure, here. I had three pieces of paper ready. I put the one with door six on it into the pot. I just needed to make sure I drew last. After I saw everyone else's result, I just chose whatever door I wanted. The number I'd already put in matched that I didn't have to switch the paper out. Well, what does it say? Wow, devious. That said there's some kaiji level exploitation there. <laughs> got lucky. All right. So we know who's going through door two. It'll be me, Lotus, and Junpei. The only problem is the other two teams. June and I want door six. Clover and I chose door one. That's not good. We can't open either of these doors with only two people. Why don't Santa and June go into door one with Ace? Huh? Well... Then what will you do, Clover? I'll... I'll be waiting at the stairs. You guys are coming back here, right? That's what Seven was saying, wasn't it? We aren't going to be split up permanently till we find door nine. <laughs> door, yes. nine, nine, door nine, 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 nine. nine. <laughs> we might get separated for a little while, but we'll see each other again. again. And, and... <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, we wouldn't be able to open door nine. nine, nine, nine. nine, nine. That's how the nonary game works. Nine. Works. works. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I just want to be my myself for a while. You understand, right? Hmm. All right, I'm going through door one. That's all right with you, June? Yes. Well, we'll be going then. I'm sure nothing, nothing will go wrong. It will be fine. You need some, need, need some soparil. <laughs> yeah, all right. Let's move to. Yeah. Right. Let's go. I won't see June for a while, but this was my choice. I'm just going to have to suck it up. Seven said we'd all see each other again, and I'm going to believe that. Seven never lies. <laughs> the other group went to A deck to go through door one. Clover joined them. Our group is on our way, too. We're headed to the bottom deck using the elevators. I wonder what we'll find down there. I've heard that sound before. I think it's the elevator. Yeah, that's... I've heard that from Deus Ex, I think. Oh, okay. We ready? Yeah, anytime. I'll go first. Oops, Minty meant to lock out of this room. Oh, yeah, jeez. I am cruel. I am now a narrator, then, for everything. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Where the hell is it this time? I don't see it. There it is, it's right there. Uh, okay. Good thing we got through that. It stopped. Yeah, it stopped. Whew, man, I'll never get used to that. I'm not sure it's something I'd want to get used to. I noticed Seven said use to. Yeah. Well, that is colloquially how people talk sometimes. Yeah. We should finish this game before imminent death becomes a normal thing. Ah, damn right. Alright. This hallway is pretty short, but it's got five doors. Three on the left, and only one on the right. Don't forget the last one at the end of the hall. I the said one. five. Yeah, the last one. But it's got a metal plate over it, so I doubt we're going to get anywhere that way. Never know until you try. Yeah, right. All right, let's get started. I think we probably better split up. You two okay with that? Yes, no problem. Sure thing. Then I'll take this first one. I'll try the one next to it. Won't. 
Well, I guess I better get started too. Donk. Uh oh. Emergence. Ha! Oh. Oh. Help See me to no find way. it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're looking at me like you expected. Ooh. Confinement, Confinement room, front, front hallway. hallway. Confinement room. Emergence room. It's so weird. This looks actually pretty complicated as as, as rooms go. Like we actually yeah. have more of these rooms. This that's just it. So yep. I guess I gotta go into the other rooms for this. Alright, well we have ourselves a puzzle. For now though, it is time to stop the installment.